Καλησπέρα σας κύριοι και κύριοι, band number four of the evening, Brute Force 21, Clash of the Titans. Five by three minute round, 72 kilogram weight division, under K1 rules. Proudly brought to you by CT Smash Repairs. When the action begins, our referee in charge is Mr. Chris Anderson. Firstly, to my right, fighting out of the blue corner, Kiris Kikiri, trained by Ioannis Theophanos from the Fight Club gym. Official weight, 70.9 kilograms, standing 5 feet 10 inches tall. Tonight, we're in a black shorts. He has a fight record of 30 fights, 24 wins, five by way of knockout. Fighting out of Galazzi, Athens, Greece. Please welcome the stealth, Nikos Ugika. And his opponent to my left, fighting out of the red corner. Trained by Bryce Barron for the Fortitude Valley Muay Thai. Official weight, 71.3 kilograms. Standing 5 feet 11 inches tall. Tonight we're in the blue shorts with a white trim. He is a three-time national New Zealand champion. Fighting out of Masterson, New Zealand. 18 fights, 14 wins, 9 by way of knockout. Representing Team Australasia, please welcome Brendan Varty. Here we go, gents. The first of our international bouts, New Zealand yeah, versus Greece. No. We've got Nikos okay. Gika, trained by yep. Yep. Is it Yanis Theophanis. Yanis yeah. Theophanis. Yanis Theophanis, Yanis Theophanis from the Fight Club Galazzi in Greece. 30 yeah. fights, yeah. 24 yeah. wins, taking on the adopted Australian here tonight, the New Zealander. Brendan Vardy, trained by Bryce Barron out of Fortitude Thai Boxing in Masterton. Three-time New Zealand champion, 18 fights, 14 wins. Five three-minute rounds, K1 <laughs> style rules. South for is Nikos. This fight proudly brought to you by CT Smash Repairs, a long-time supporter of Brute Force Promotions. Yeah, they're great supporters, the, the boys down at CT Smash Repairs. Brendan Vardy using the jabs. Ooh, big slapping round kick from Nikos. Straight into that left rib cage of Brendan. Nikos weighed in at uh, just under 71 kilos. Brendan just over 71. Experience going the way of the Greek fighter. 30 fights under his belt. Take nothing away from Brendan Barty, a three-time New Zealand champion. WMC New Zealand champion at 69 kilos. And the Thai Boxing Association New Zealand champion at 73 kilos. That floats between the two. Very impressed though with the... Uh, the boy they called the Stealth Nikos. He's countering well. His punches are very fast, very accurate. He's loading up a lot more, Justin, with his shots as well. Looks like he's got a lot more power in his hands than Brendan Vardy at the moment. Of course, Brendan uh, trained by Bryce Barron. We saw Bryce Barron over here many years ago. Johnny kept taking on Judd Reed in Judd Reed's only Thai boxing fight. That's here correct. In Melbourne. Right here in uh, Coburg Town Hall. Having a chat to Bryce earlier on, and he, he said it didn't matter what judge was throwing him, those big axe kicks that he was trying to drop on him. I think Bryce had about a five inch height advantage as well, and Bryce, uh, Judd Reed was dropping the big axe kicks down on his head. Stop! Stop! No. Don't slap. This. Yeah? Don't slap. Chris Anderson just warning for using the. The front of the glove. Didn't quite see it from where, where we were sitting. Yeah, unfortunately, Nikos with his back to us, but the uh, referee Chris Anderson, a uh, good view of the. Obviously, felt that it was worth a warning, but. Good ring smarts there from Nikos, who just sort of cutting off the angles of, of Brendan Vardy. Look, I'm impressed with his first round from both fighters because not, not, a, not a lot of wasted shots really from, uh, from either fighter. Picking their shots nicely here. We're seeing a good combination, good strong hands, which would impress you, Justin. It does, Johnny Cav. It's, uh, yeah, Nikos, he counters very well, but equal to the task. Brendan, hands are up all the time. He's only been tagged with a couple. And countering there again, Brendan Vardy. Well done. So 10 seconds ago in this first round, proudly brought to you by CT Smash Repairs. Haven't seen any knees at this stage. Tell you what, no feeling air process there in that first round. Yeah. Action pack, very impressed with the boy they call the Stealth Nikos from Greece. Of course, Brendan Vardy as well. The 
think just the hands of uh, Nikos at the moment seem to be just that little bit stronger. Only one. Outside, yeah. Seconds out. Seconds out, please. To the stealth, Nikos Gika taking on Brendan Vardy. Big thanks to CT Smash Repairs. Yes, Nikos in the black shorts, Brendan Vardy in the blue shorts with the white trim. Good to see ringside too, legend of Australian kickboxing, Stan the Man Longanides. Stan the Man was at the weigh in yesterday. Stan, a very passionate, uh, passionate Greek Australian, Johnny Cav. Yeah, absolutely. and. Uh, <laughs> Always well, welcome ringside. Glad we haven't got him commentating tonight because when the Greeks are fighting, he tends to take his headphones off and walk over to the corner and give them, give them instructions. <laughs> nice combination from Brendan Vardy, but just taken on the gloves by Nikos. This one's K1 style rule, so you let a lock on with one hand, knee, then you've got to release again. Yep. At the moment, it's very much a kickboxing fight. Yeah, pretty much no knees thrown whatsoever. Good straight left hand from Nikos. Nikos just seems to have the stronger hands at the moment, Justin. He does, Bushy. But Brendan working him out well, staying away by going around to the left hand side. As soon as he goes around to the right, that's when he's getting tagged with those left hands. Left hook, tempted teep from uh, Brendan Vardy. Now goes downstairs. It's going to slip there from Nikos. Okay, okay, okay. Fight! Of course, Brendan Vardy taking this one under K1 rules. He's a WMC New Zealand champion, so he's used to fighting under full tie rules. Well, he's showing uh, terrific control here in centre ring and a good adaptation to the rules of this fight because he hasn't attempted to put uh, the clinch or try and knee under tie rules at all. Good smart work too from Nikos here. You can see Brendan was just moving off to his left. Good hands there from Brendan Vardy. But he was cutting off the angles, Nikos. Very impressed with his ring control. Yeah, he's done him very good work from Brendan to work himself out of that neutral corner. It looked like uh, Nikos was just trying to line him up. George Kolovos and Brute Force promotion. This is Clash of the Titans. Big finish of the year here at the Coburg Town Hall. I think early next year, talk of a, a Super 8 at 62 kilos. Looking forward to that one. Well, we haven't had a Brute Force Super 8 for quite a long time, Johnny. I think since the days at the Melbourne Town Hall. Great combination from Brendan Barton. Although we did have a Super 8 here. We did Johnny Cab with Chris Tiger White. Sunny Vanetti, Corey Gualiasi, and a few others. Oh, oh. Yeah, good second round there from both boys. Both boys just looking a little bit ginger walking back to the corner is Brendan Vardy, but a great performance from, from both fighters. Let's go. Round three, proudly brought you by CT Smash Repairs. The stealth Nikos Higika taking on Brendan Vardy. Oh, good work by Brendan there. It's like the way the Nikos uses the ring. Brendan just start chopping away the lead leg of Nikos as well. Ooh, good strong left hand from uh, Nikos. Putting, pushing Brendan back into the ropes. But Brendan uh, opening up this round, one combination after the other. Putting together punches and kick combos. Really hasn't thrown any single techniques. And you know how much I love my combos, John. <laughs> just like when you go into the Chinese restaurant, Mark. I was waiting for Combination, it. Combinations <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Bryce Barron uh, up on his feet, getting very vocal over there. Of course, we've got Stan the Man Longanides, guest, uh, guest training in the corner. 
Yeah, well, it didn't take Stan long to, before he worked his way into the blue corner, offering some support to uh, Team Greece. Slapping in sort of leg kick there from Nikos. A kick from Nikos just resounding around the Coburg Town Hall. Justin, as a former boxer, how do you reckon you would have gone with uh, getting, con getting condition with some of those leg kicks? Yeah, definitely not my forte, Bushy. <laughs> Yeah, the uh, legs in boxing is for dancing, not uh, <laughs> not being maimed. But uh, I'm very impressed with uh, Brendan's boxing ability tonight. He's not shirked by the, by the experience of Nikos at all. Again, trying the right hand, lead right rib. It's a perfect opportunity to be nice and close to step up for a knee. Brendan didn't use it, of course, he's not let it catch. A little bit scrappy that tack down, but uh, Nikos ending up on the canvas. Just knock a little bit of wind out of him. Quickly back onto his feet though. Now pushes forward. Yeah, big thanks to CT Smash Repairs getting behind George Colovos. Brute Force Promotions. Both fighters exchanging high round kicks. Either really finding the mark. Judges for this one are Ignatius Misalides, Mark Cook, and Nigel Wilson. Oh, Brendan right above our commentary position here. Nice body shot. He's turned it up in his third round as, as Brendan Barty. Ten seconds to go. Doubling up on the kicks, working the outside of the lead leg plus the supporting leg. Very high work rate from Brendan Barty in that third round. Yeah, much better third round there from Brendan Barty. And, uh, Nikos looks like going back into the corner just looks a little bit worse for where Brendan Barty's really been working the body really well, Justin. He has been, mate. The round four. Here we go, round four on it. Nikos just a little bit slow to get out of the corner chair. Get big shout out to CT Smash Repairs, long term supporters of George Colavos and Brute Force Promotions. Yeah, Nikos looking a little bit worse for wear at the end of that um, third round. He would have been happy to hear the bell, but uh, he seems to have recovered quite well. Brendan Barty using the hands. Hand from uh, Nikos, but uh, Brendan he just continues to fight back. He's worn all the big shots from Nikos. He's working the body a lot more too, Brendan Vardy at the moment. He just can't quite get under that right elbow of Nikos, but if he did, I think there's enough power there to almost have the same effect as Brad Peterson. Watch, 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 watch. The front kick deep from uh, Brendan Vardy just to. Try and keep Nikos at range. Oh, just slip there from, uh, okay. from Nikos okay. as well. Okay, okay. Fight. I think they arrived on Monday or Tuesday, the Greek team as well. So they should have acclimatised by now, but Nikos is a. Uh, Brendan just looks like he could keep going all night. Keep that step up team from uh, Nikos. Straight body right there from, from Nikos. I think Nikos has certainly got the, the power on his side in his hands compared to Brendan, but Brendan's work rate is just relentless at the moment. Yeah, actually, I was just thinking, gentlemen, you know, I wonder whether either fight has got the, the knockout punch. Although we've seen that it happened on many an occasion, but I think they've pretty much given each other their best shot so far, and they're both still standing. So, in my opinion, it's going to come down to fitness here. Yeah, absolutely. Both very tenacious, Johnny Cat. Fit season. And I think uh, Brendan's definitely earned the respect of Nicholas. First time for us seeing uh, Brendan Barty fight here in Melbourne, and I've got to say, gents, I'm impressed. Good use 
of the ring by Brendan Vardy. Let go of that uh, left roundhouse kick. Quickly stepped to the side of Nikos, not Bryce, giving him a target at all. Bryce Barron, very vocal over in the corner, really calling Bright, uh, Brendan on. Again, another good fourth round there. The penultimate round from Brendan Vardy. Two down, sorry, four down, one to go. Big thanks to the CT Smash Repairs. Second Z, please. Wipe this up there, bro. Fighters touch gloves. That's left. Fifth and final round. Here we go. Fifth and final round of the first installment of Greece versus Australasia. Nikos the Stealth Geeka taking on Brendan Vardy. For us, we've got Brendan Vardy up on the cards at the moment. Yeah, Brendan has uh, been very, very busy and effective with his combinations. But Nikos now got him on the back foot. Smart work from Brendan. He's just keeping away from the hands of Nikos. Nice high roundhouse kick from Nikos. Nikos, Nikos from the, uh, the Ophanis elite team over there. In Greece, full credit to George Kolovos bringing out the Greek team as well. Yeah, look, it's a great effort from Xi'an George uh, to, to finish off uh, 2012 Brute Force number 21. Gents, is that like a bruise above the right knee of Nikolos there? The outside kicks of Brendan? It just seems to be. A bit blacker than the rest of his legs. Yeah, right? absolutely. Uh, well spotted, uh, Justin. The right thigh of uh, of Nikos has a very, very red welt. Shows. Uh, oh, good uppercut. Oh, good power. Brendan has been peppering away at that leg, and uh, while on the back foot, we see him just trying to kick that lead leg as well. But now Nikos. Uh, Nikos trying looks... to perhaps put the lights out on Brendan. Once again, slipping on the canvas. Got to give Nikos one thing, though. He's stalked Brendan Vardy. Brendan Vardy's been on the back foot all the time, but he's been counter scoring really well. And Nikos again just cutting off the angles. You can see Nikos just looks like he's one dimensional now, just trying to finish up with that one big. Big shot, Brendan Vardy working the, the kicks and the hands really well. Good work there from Brendan Vardy, he's catching it. And the gloves. Once again, Brendan continues to throw combination after combination. It's a single jump. Good hands there from Nikos coming over the top, trying to finish off now. A good smart work there from Brendan Vardy, just trying to keep out of the range. First attempted knee there from Nikos as well for the yeah. whole fighters. We said this yeah. one under K1 rules. Took him five rounds to launch the first knee. Oh, there you go. This one will go to the judges. The first of our international bouts, Nikos Giga and Brendan Vardy from New Zealand team, Australasia. Mate, I've got it going the way of the red corner, but I'm going to sit on the fence on this one. <laughs> Justin, your opinion? Oh, I think the, that uh, Brendan just took the fight up to Nicholas. Nicholas, the classier fighter by far, but I mean, yeah, Brendan did everything he needed to. To the hands of Ignatius Bissolides, Mark Cook, and Nigel Wilson, and a big thanks to CT Smash Repairs. Ladies and gentlemen, before we have the judges' scorecard, big round of applause to both fighters for a fantastic contest. Under K1 rules. After five rounds of action, we go to the judges scorecard. It is a unanimous decision. Ignatius Bissolides had it 50-45. Mark Cook had it 49-46. And Nigel Wilson had it 50-48. Your winner, red corner, Brendan! <laughs>